Yo, that new two chains featuring Drake and Wayne. I do it. It's dope, man. Uh, if y'all haven't checked it out, definitely go check the show more directory. Check my about section. I got the full links to the full story below and the song. Um, Boats too, man. Based on a true story too, leaked. I don't know how it happened, but you know, it was supposed to drop, I think, on September 9th. So, you know, people usually leak their stuff. Not like the artist, but it tends to just get leaked. I don't know how, but it tends to get leaked early. Uh, but this one is dope, man. If you guys haven't heard it, man, definitely got to go check it out. To me, I think it's like sort of. It, it, it sounds like a typical 2 chains beat. You know what I'm saying? But what I like is the Drake track. I mean, Drake just kills this beat, man. You know what I'm saying? Drake really been killing a lot of stuff lately. And I'm this is this has got me eager for nothing was the same. I don't know about y'all, but this and Lil Wayne, you know what I'm saying? This got me eager to for nothing was the same. The track is dope, like I said, man. Y'all got to go check it out. Um, you know, Boats 2, man, elite. Hey, man, it is what it is. I mean, nowadays, people leak their stuff all the time. I mean, just look at the dream. Um, leak in the, the 1977, he leaked his whole album and then redid it and put it out. Um, so, I mean, it is what it is. Also, uh, a lot of artists, they tend to do this. I mean, you know, J. Cole did it. You know, um, The Weeknd done it. You know, so a lot of people will just... Let that go, you know, put it out there, you know, to build some momentum. So when the album do drop, the official album drop, people be like, yeah, I got to buy it, man. I got to hit it off of iTunes. Plus, you know, nowadays, like, album sales really isn't that big of a thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, album sales is not so much uh, everything. I mean, for the record companies it is, I guess. But, you know, the artists... They barely, rarely make money off of album sales. You know what I'm saying? Nowadays, it's more making money off of touring and shows. You know what I'm saying? That's why it's better to just put the music out, to get it out to people's ears so they know what it is and embrace it. And then, therefore, you can turn around and, you know, uh, go do shows and be profitable with it. I mean, like Drake, for instance, the So Far Gone album. That was a mixtape. But, you know, he made so much money off of that because... He basically gave it away for free. You know what I'm saying? And, um, I mean, you know, it's kind of a smart move. You know what I mean? So, I mean, you know, Boast 2 officially leaked. You know, I do it. It's pretty dope, man. Y'all got to go check that out. Like I say, man, it is a dope track. Um, just a genuine 2 Chains track. You know, it doesn't sound like anything else. You know, I always love when 2 Chains and Drake collaborate, man. They always do something good. And then, you know, him and Lil Wayne, too. So, you know, all three of them on the track. It's definitely dope. And uh, speaking of Lil Wayne, man, the D5 is growing on, growing on me, dog. I don't know, man. The D5 is dope. It's growing on me. Like I said, I want to know what y'all think about it. If y'all haven't heard it, man, do yourself a favor. Check that show more directory. I don't really know what you're doing, man. You know what I'm saying? Check that about section. You know, listen to the music. Uh, look at the news story. And, um, yeah, man, that's it. I will definitely see you guys on the next one. Until then, it's your partner, Just Mike. Stay up. Much love. Like I said, I want to know what you guys think about, you know, people leaking their albums early. And what do you think about this song? But, uh, oh, and also, what do you think about D5? But uh, that's it for this one, man. See you guys on the next one. I'm out.